girls 17 18 200 yard breaststroke in lane number one at the bottom of your screen is laura turpin unattached lane two natalie garger unattached lane three katie records unattached lane four your leader from this morning shannon holton with a 220 84 also unattached lane five megan overy Cottonwood, Lane 6, Lauren Becker, Edmonton, Lane 7, Michelle Michelson, unattached, and in Lane 8, Casey Williams, Nova of Virginia. Early leader out there in lane number 4, check out Shannon Holton out in 31-38. Very, very smooth looking stroke there for Holton. Nice and long compared to the tempo around her. You'd think that Shannon might be a pretty mean 200 breaststroker as well, but here comes lane number five, Megan Overy of Cottonwood Heights. This is the 200 breast, not the 100 breast, so that explains the nice long stroke, but catching her rhythm a little bit in lane number five is Megan Overy. Halfway leader though, still Shannon Holton from lane number four, 105 71 to Overy's 106 19. 105 7, that's, I don't know a lot about breaststroke, but that's a pretty good first half for a 200 breaststroke. Overy was a 222 this morning. Um, your leader, Holton, was a 220, so ladies are very close at this three quarters mark. And they've really separated themselves from the rest of this field as you get a good shot right there of Shannon Holton in lane number four rocking that red cap. Megan Overy in the orange cap right above her at the 150. These girls just two tenths of a second apart. Great pullouts from both girls. It looks like the slight advantage belongs to Shannon Holton in lane number four though. Followed by Shannon Holton in lane four. This is anybody's race. Ladies both surface from that pullout almost simultaneously. It looks like Holton is pulling away just slightly. And it's Holton in lane four, 218, 12. And right behind her by just a few tenths of a second is lane five, Overy, 218.53. And safe to say, third place belonged to Katie Records, 222.65.